Wanderer has blended in pretty well. We all get along with him, except for... Xiao! Hmm? Come join us! He's been more distant lately. Considering Wanderer's attitude, their personalities might clash. I can hear you. Why don't you two do today's commissions together? <sighs> you have yet to talk to each other, right? Nice to meet you, Geo Archon's bootlicker. I saw you jumping up and down the other day. Do you just have the silliest fighting style or was that a pathetic attempt to fly? Why not show me your bird form? I heard it looks like a fat finch. Go get me some dipping sauce and serve yourself before me, chicken nugget. <sighs> Nah, there is no need to exchange pleasantries. It's rather pathetic to force a conversation just to occupy silence. We're both DPS, we bring our lackeys. I do me, you do you. Hmm. And so they got along. See you later, guys! I could have done this myself, but it's nice being served like this. You don't know how to apply this makeup. I don't want you to waste it. If that worries you, why lending me your oh-so-precious Adeptus makeup in the first place? You said you ran out of makeup. <sighs> Stop calling us selfish DPS just because we have no support capabilities. Stop calling us support servants, youngster. Lackeys, then. He doesn't mean it that way. Please don't misunderstand. That was uncalled for. Don't act as if you know how I feel. I don't. But I know what it's like not being able to admit or express your honest feelings. Oh? Well, are you finally ready to admit you have the shittiest life ever? Want to retire? And sit on hats all day? Finches are all the same, huh? I told you, I'm not a finch. I can't believe this fat finch is the almighty Adeptus Shao. Stop it. He insisted on fighting even though he's worn out. So I told him to shut up and take a break today. I'll keep watch. You can leave him with me. I'll play him some songs. Please do. Ugh. I could hear the sounds of someone in agony, so I came. What are you doing? I'm taste testing my cooking. It's disgusting. Huh? Which probably means it's a success. Happy birthday and enjoy your almond tofu. Ill. Do you want a baklava? No thanks. Not very fond of sweets. Bitter stuff is more to my taste. I think you will like it. After all, don't you think sharing food is bittersweet? Huh? Did you not get the joke? Also, baklava is made with algeolo nut nuts, so I added an extra pun. Tch, I hate thunder. Reminds me of my mom. I'm not so much a fan of it either. You don't strike me as someone who's bothered by thunder. It's too loud for my ears. Ugh. Besides that, I got hit by lightning once, and it left me with a very specific scar. <laughs> it's an interesting phenomena, but looking at it pisses me off. It was me! Cole has been studying very diligently. Huh? With Kasachi of all people. Does she want to become a scholar? How did I fail to notice? Are you working on a paper? That is fine and all, but Cole, as a forest ranger and trainee, be mindful of partaking in scholar activities. If you want to study at the academy, you should... Uh? We're just working on a detailed plan on how to take revenge on Dottore. You can do it, Kasachi! You're doing great! Don't lose! Don't worry about your skill! Use your charged attack! Huh? I can handle chasing away some fungi. What has gotten into you? I got a bit nostalgic. He reminds me of my past animal battle pet fungus friend, Twirly Whirly. Please, do not tell him I said that, though. An unusual guest? Have you come to see our magic show? In this world of visions, we see magical stuff every day. I'll probably fall asleep. Now, now! Magic is more than just manipulation of elements. I will always look for ways to surprise my audience. My handmade doll that I keep in my pocket! Wouldn't he? A good expression! This doll is yours, isn't it? It's taken good care of. That's adorable. Come see our magic show! I will invite you to the stage for more fun tricks! Of course, I will return your doll there. Wait, fool! Give it back! Welcome to the stage, dear chosen guest. Ladies and gentlemen, let's give him a warm applause! The first trick is making all your clothes disappear. <gasps> Ready? Using my hat, I will demonstrate my newest trick in one, two, three! Our guest has now vanished from his spot, successfully swapping places with my cat! Mm. Oh dear, I lost track of that guy. What is this cat doing in my hat? This is not my cat. Whose cat is this? <laughs> They called me the unfriendliest cat in the neighborhood, but someone was willing to take me in. I'm home! 
Hmm? She sounds gloomy. I'm okay. It was just a rough day. Always grooming yourself, I see. Aren't you a proper kitty? And I wouldn't want to interrupt you, but... Please allow me to cuddle you for a bit. The rainforest is full of dangers. If you want to come with me, do so at your own risk. Okay, I will look after myself. Oh, is that a tiger in the distance? Uh, huh? Kasachi, who is that person? Shut up. Not another word. Being smaller is so much fun. I love hide and seek. Shh. <laughs> I finally got a hold of one of the hardest books to get your hands on. The same person kept borrowing it non-stop. That was until he obtained a special hardcover version. Dory mentioned she tried to buy it from him without success. I too became curious to read it. I saw him reading it once, with an expression I had never seen on him before. To think Kazuchi's favorite book is a fairy tale. Sethos, focus. I plan to play for at least eight hours. That is pretty cute. <laughs>